I did use Storm on the job um, for the first time probably about two weeks ago when one of our officers brought that back. We had a, a encounter with a, a female on the street, female suspect we were taking into custody, who uh, got pretty bucky with us and uh, wound up went hands on. And we actually used that two officer um, handcuffing technique and, and gained complete compliance over her because she just had nowhere to move once we had her in that position. So the control we gained from using that technique compared to what we were, what we were doing before was extremely beneficial. I work in a hospital, I work in close quarters, and I had to, you know, um, there was a patient that was punching nurses, I had to go in. Um, I was able to protect my face, um, got a couple hits to my elbows, but not to my face. Um, went right into that, get in that right, uh, rear clinch, and able to wait for more staff to get there, um, get the meds that they needed, and um, honestly help not only for myself getting hurt, but other people around from getting more hurt. For me personally, the grappling-based um, techniques have worked better um, than the striking techniques. They've been safer, I feel, uh, for both me and the suspect, um, and have, they've had better results. Weapons on your belt don't always work, um, so it kind of gives you that second tool. If things are kind of going down and you're in a fight, you know what to do. You can take them to the ground and you know what to do once you're on the ground. You come to a fight, you see someone punching, you don't really want to take those punches and this really shows you, you know, so you don't have to have that punching fight. For me, um, they give different variations for smaller statue people. I took their female officer course as well. Um, both have been very useful for me and, you know, I can ask them any question, you know, I don't know if this will work for me, so they'll give me a different option, which is very, really nice. You're able to um, practice these techniques at you know, 100% against a resisting opponent, and the chance chance of injury is a lot less. Uh, I think the, the flow drills and then the live, you know, a little bit faster pace, I think I learned a lot more from those just because it was more real world and we had to work our way out of a situation by using different techniques they've given us throughout the week. I've been to other courses where you kind of see them jumping all over, they don't really have a flow, um, but these guys, they're awesome. And then. You know, always reviewing what we taught so it's easy to remember it's not just shown something and then not brought it up again. I had so much fun. I'd say probably the only thing that I didn't like about the course is that I can't come back next week and do it all over again. That's how much fun it's been. If you want to send an officer to one of our upcoming courses, it's easy. Just go online at www.stormcombatives.com. We have a link there to register and there's more course information available. We always look forward to upcoming STORM courses. We get to meet new, interesting people from different agencies. We see old friends returning, and it's fun to watch the transformation from Monday where people feel a little standoffish if they've never met us before, to the camaraderie that we develop by a Friday afternoon when everyone's graduating. We really feel like people um, benefit from the course, and we benefit as instructors and enjoy the training that we do. Contact us today. Go to www.stormcombatives.com or email us at stormcombatives at gmail.com.